Hey everybody, I'm Amy. I'm Dan. And we are the Hustle Couple coming at you today with my most favorite video of all time. I've been planning this for so long. Dan has no idea what's going on. I, I'm just along for the ride today, people. <laughs> uh, I've been wanting to make this video for over a year <clears throat> and I wanted to make its own dedicated... I've alluded to these things in the past, but I wanted to make its own dedicated video for people that need motivation listing. Right. So, reselling's all good and well. First, there's lots of new people. Oh, yeah! Lots of new people as of today, which is awesome. Welcome to the channel. Uh, we are full-time resellers in Dallas, Texas, and our channel is focused on mainly education to help you be a better reseller. And make more money. Make more money. So I have noticed in, we've been reselling for four years and most of the people we've met along the way are reselling for various reasons, but mainly because the traditional workplace doesn't work for them. So whether that be they have children and need to stay at home or they're neurodivergent or they have a disability, something that keeps them out of a normal traditional workplace. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. All of the advice on YouTube though makes reselling into a workplace that you can't survive in. Oh, if you just list a hundred <laughs> items a day, you'll be good. Oh, is what? that all? That's all I need to do? Sweet. Okay. Who the heck can do that? Nobody can do that, <clears> right? <throat> so this is the video for you. This is the video that I want you to bookmark and that you're going to come back to over. Also, because I'm wearing this amazing cape, you're going to remember it. Right. And you're going to come back here over and over again. If you're new here or if you're fairly new, you might not know that I was an educator for 10 years. I was a high school teacher. I have a master's degree in education but I'm also neurodivergent. I suffer from OCD. Very, very plain and simple. So I know a lot about teaching people and I know a lot about accommodations and I know a lot about struggles. I also have autoimmune disease. It's rough, right? Working a nine to five is rough or a nine to 10 or 18 hour day like I used to work. Not gonna happen anymore. It's just yeah. not in the cards. So there are the, these days when you resell and you watch these YouTube videos where you're like kind of discouraged because everyone's out there making this into an enterprise. And you're like, I, j I just want to list some things and make some money so I can feed my family, right? <laughs> We're that channel for you. We're the, just make enough money to feed your family. Do what you can do. So we are going to take today and spend some time showing you how to list quickly and ship quickly no matter what. So yeah. if you have five minutes, 10 minutes, 20 minutes, you can still get listings up. This is the main part of your business that cannot go by the wayside. As long as you list, you will make money. True. And if we just boil it down to its basic parts, and I'm gonna show you how I do it the quickest and battle my own demons to get it done, mm -hmm. hopefully that can help you at home too. We're gonna to start with listing, how I list on eBay, but you could apply this to Poshmark or Mercari or wherever. And then we're gonna show you how we ship quickly to overcome some of my issues uh, with OCD in shipping out things to perfection. Yes. Because that the perfectionist tendencies that a lot of people have will stop you dead in your tracks uh -huh. in this business. Yeah, in, in both aspects, the listing and the, the shipping, because I know, I, I, I understand when people say they get frozen at the eBay screen, when it's like create new listing and you're looking at a giant screen of empty text boxes and you're like, ah, ah, ah. I, we, I, I get that, totally. we get that and hopefully this will help you get through that. Okay, first things first, we're gonna hop over to my computer. I'm gonna show you a screen share of how I start listing on eBay in the order of events that I do. <laughs> but the first thing I do before I even think about reselling, I know this is this sounds pretty simple, but I get my things that I need. And for me, I have recognized that it's three things. I have to have a blanket or a wearable situation. I don't know why, just figure out what your <laughs> thing is. I have to be enveloped in something that's like a security for me. I don't know why, but I'm wearing it, it's fine, I got it. The second thing is I have to have a drink and I have to have my chapstick. I can't work without those things, but yeah. I know that about myself. So I get all my things together and then I sit down. Let's go. All right, let's go. Hi. Okay. So what I have done, is, okay. First of all, I abandon perfectionism with my desk. It's never going to be clean. It's fine. I'm going to move on. <laughs> okay. okay. I've taken these four things, maybe five. Okay, I'm going to have to readjust my... Okay. Oh, that's very nice. These were all in our death pile. And the reason that they're sitting in our death pile is because I don't know how to list them. These are not in my wheelhouse and I'm paralyzed. Okay. Okay. There's some like vintage Pyrex in here and I'm not, I'm not paralyzed because it's vintage Pyrex. I'm paralyzed 
when I actually think about it because I know that there are experts out there and I don't want to list it wrong. Okay, that but makes sense. you know what, though? Not, not listing it at all is wrong. <laughs> <laughs> it's never going to sell, right? So I'm going to show you the methods and we're going to time ourselves on how long this is going to take me. I'm going to use a variety of services, one of them being Google Lens. I use it all the time, but not all the time. So I'm going to walk you through it. I'm going to talk about it as I go. I think I can list, I think this is going to turn into five because I think this is going to be by itself and then these two will be together. I think it's going to be five listings and we're going to see how long it takes us. Okay. Okay. All right. Do you want to time me? Sure. On your thing? Yeah. Okay. Okay. These are all things. This is a frozen Tervis tumbler. This is a something I don't know. This is Pyrex and this is Ray Dunn. All of it's scary to me. All of it's been in the death pile. Here's my chapstick. Okay. There's your tea. <laughs> I'm ready. <laughs> okay. Okay. Are you ready? I am ready. Go. Okay. All right. Okay. I'm going to start with the Pyrex. Okay. So I know that I need to use Google Lens on this to get what this pattern is. Right. So I go to Google on my phone, the Google app. And then I'm going to click on this camera. No, I'm not. It's fine. Okay. okay, I'm going to click on the camera, and then I'm just going to scan the pattern, right? And look, it's already coming up, so I'm going to go very, very quickly. It's the butter Butterprint Amish. Okay, so then I'm going to go to eBay. Pyrex Butterprint. Oh, somebody's already had Butterprint Amish. Okay. I'm not going to look at these. My OCD self cannot look at these. <laughs> I'm going to go directly to the solds. You have to shield yourself. Sold items. This is what things are selling for. I don't care what they're listed for. Okay, lids appear to be more valuable. I don't have lids. Uh, great. Okay, okay, I'm stopping. This is what I have. This is the baking dish. Stop when you find something. Do not keep <laughs> scrolling. This is serious because I'll scroll all dang day. Yeah. Okay. $29.99. I'm going to list this exact thing. It doesn't have a lid. It's it's sold. I know that's what it's worth. And $15 shipping. That's a lot. Okay. It is a lot. So I clicked on it, and then I'm going to go to sell one like this. You don't have to zoom in because they'll have a screen recording. Right. Sell one like this, and there it is. All my title. Butterprint. And I know that it's going to work because it's sold. Okay. This is going to go in our SKU 1500 Now, a lot of people say to go through and batch things. If you are neurodivergent, have any kind of ADD or OCD, that is not going to work for you. I recommend doing one thing at a time. Okay? So I'm, I just have this little light box. I think it was $30 off Amazon. You can, whatever you need. I'm just going to take pictures, like right now. Got to make myself do it. I'm just like, I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know. But if it's not listed, it's never going to sell. Right? Use right. I'm not even the best photographer. Like Dan's way better than me. That's mm. nice. Thank you. Oh, oh, well, upside down. You can adjust the... Oh, there's like a whole thing. See, this is me. Just don't take a picture if there's like a little speck. <laughs> Just don't take a picture of that. Okay, there's no... It appears to be no chips. So you can see the edges of my light box. I'm just not going to care. Okay? So I'm going to go to my photos here. I go to all photos. And then I, I go to select. I have an iPhone. So if you have another phone, you got to figure it out. And I'm just going to um, airdrop these to myself right now. I'm doing it right now. I'm not photo rooming them. I'm not doing anything. Because people don't care. They know what they're buying. Certain things. If it was worth more, right? But 30 bucks. Right. Airdrop to my MacBook. I'm doing this all at one time so I can have a small victory. This thing will be listed. <laughs> Okay, so while that's going, it takes a while, I'm just going to go through and make sure all of these details, I don't know what kind of production style. See, I just don't get hung up in that. I don't know. Whoever's buying it will know. I am going to measure it, though, because the measurement is not there. I have a tape measure taped to my thing over here. Handy. Approximately 9 by 7. Excellent use condition. Uh, I have keyboard shortcuts. We'll make a video on that for you. Um, no chips, cracks, or what's the other word? Cra crazing or something? People say? Uh, yeah. Grazing, crazing, no chips or cracks. How about that? That works. <laughs> See photos. 
We know it sold for $29.95, so I'm just gonna, I'm gonna do exactly what it sold for. Take out, so we have a standard ground plus local, 15 plus local, meaning that if they wanna do local pickup, they can. Just take be, out. Yeah, ground shipping, $15. That's a business uh, shipping policy that we created. I'm gonna do 7.8% promotion. Eh. Just take out all the variables. We're gonna see if these pictures came in. See, they look terrible, it's fine. They do. <laughs> what? Oh, that's funny. They don't look terrible. They look pretty terrible, but I'm going to put the best one first. Okay, this is what I want to do. I'm going to go to brighten this baby up a little bit. Look at that. Hey. It's fine. It'll, this thing will get sold, right? Save. Oh, don't do that one. It just depends. <laughs> Sometimes that one works really well, like the auto. Yeah. I just brighten up a couple of them so they get the idea, you know, maybe this one. And then whichever one is the best is the one I put as the first one because that's what's, this one's probably the best, huh? Yeah, you can see the full print and the, the whole thing. Okay, so we'll put that one as the first picture. And I could have put a ruler in there, but I didn't. But you know what? Brand Pyrex. Update. Color. No, it's white. Um, model. All right, update. List. Done. Boom. Okay, so that's one. Could you put, how long did that take? Five and a half minutes. Okay, but you know what? This is going to go faster because I know what these are. Exactly. So I'm going to go Pyrex Butter, what was it? Buttercream? Butter, dang it, what was it called? Something Amish. Butterprint Amish. <laughs> I think these are um, refrigerator, re, re, yeah, refrigerator dish because I listed one of these the other day. Not this one, but. Okay, don't look. Nope, 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 nope. Not looking, not looking. I'm kind of looking. Don't look. Sold. All right, I don't have lids. Here we go. Amish white dish. Perfect. And I have a lot of two, so I'm just going to use this one. It was 11 bucks, so I'll do 20 bucks, right? Sure. Okay, so I'm like, see how I'm not getting caught up in looking at every single comp? Like, no one's got time for that. Re refrigerator white dish, lot of two. This is four by three, four by three, and six by four, six by four. Okay, I'm gonna take my photos quickly because it takes them a while to upload. So I do that first. Okay, I'm just gonna go to my camera. Mm hmm. Just, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm brightening it up a little bit, but not too much so you can see what's, you know. Right, because you're doing the white things and it gets the white background. And... Yeah. I swear I'm not a terrible photographer, but it kind of looks like it right now. Again, I'm just making sure it. I don't ever want to take a picture of my hand, though. I feel real weird about that. I do too. <laughs> Oh, and I'm in square mode. Make sure you're in square mode. Okay, that's all I'm doing. I don't care. Okay, all photos. And again, I'm going ultra fast just to show you when you are lacking motivation that you can get it done. You can do it. Okay, I'm gonna airdrop them to myself, my book. Oh, lot of two. Okay, I'm gonna go down here and I'm just gonna drag them into the photos and then I fill in all the things. 1500 is our SKU for all of our breakables. We're not really picking up breakables anymore. Yeah, That's why so I wanted much. to get them listed because yeah. we don't want them anymore, but if they're in our death pile, we're never gonna get past it. No lids. Oh, no. White refrigerator dish lot of two. Well, I'll just put no lids down there. Okay, or I could no lids. There yes. You go. There Boom. you go. Okay, condition use my keyboard shortcut. Excellent use condition. I don't have one for no chips or cracks. Not yet. I know. <laughs> okay. Uh, great capacity. E. I'm gonna. I don't. I don't know about that. I don't know about that. Uh, number of compartments, one. Okay, 
Okay, so I gotta take all this stuff out of here because I have a lot of two, you feel what I'm saying? Mm hmm yep. But it's okay, people know what they're buying. Um, excellent use condition, no chips or cracks. True, and when you really think about that, I mean, it, like, nobody's gonna be browsing eBay and stumble across a listing of vintage Pyrex and be like, ooh. Right. <laughs> Sell a lot, too. And then I can... I wonder what size those are. Okay, let's see if the photos have updated. They have. So I'm going to go here and brighten them. I know that this light in this light box is bright, but for some reason when they come into eBay, they just, they look dinge. You got to you gotta give them a little work sometimes. And sometimes it's, this takes a while, so I'm only going to do it where I have to. The, f the main photo is what's going to sell your item. True. See, this one, I can't even brighten it at all. I'm going to cancel and whatever. And also... That's great. That's fine. Um, the item condition field in the description. Yeah. So, I mean, stuff Listed. you... Yeah, stuff you want people to know, put in the in the first one, in the item, in the condition description. Because when you're browsing things on your mobile device, which is where the majority of people are probably looking at eBay listings. Okay, the, yes, keep sorry. Sorry. The no. description doesn't even, like you have to press an extra button to show the description and most people don't ever do that. That's okay. all I was gonna say. Yes, I agree with that. Tumblr, Tervis Tumblr Frozen. I, I guarantee this is not worth much. Hot tip. Hot give, tip. Give them the hot tip. I'm not using Google Lens because I can just look this up quicker, right? It yeah. just sells similar from something. Find the one, here we go, $9. I'm not even going to, to solds, I don't care. It's worth nine dollars. I don't care. Um, tell them the hot tip about Tom Tervis. Oh, about their lifetime guarantee yeah. or warranty. So, yeah, if if they break or crack, you can send them back to Tervis, and depending on you know, it's their discretion, but they most likely will replace it for you. There's details on their website and how, how to send them in, and I believe you can send in up to six per day. It's it's a lot. <laughs> yes, and if we cared more, we would, but we got this for free, so it's totally fine. Uh, I'm just going to add all these specifics, because why not, right? Yeah. There. Um, and then I'm going to take the photos. This one should be... You want to take at least four photos for eBay? Don't do less than that. And I'm going to try to get the sides out of this one, because I can there is a little bit of discoloration on the thing and I'll take a picture of the lid to show that oh my god my hand I don't like my <laughs> hand to be in it oh gosh chasing it around I don't know oh I could have just done that duh Amy what would Dan do he would do the bottom and this is also to show you guys that, like, just because you're one person doesn't mean you, you can still do everything. I know a lot of people watch this and they're like, well, you're two people, and Dan, it's kind of nasty in there. <laughs> Somebody's been drinking iced tea out of this. All right, we'll have to put that in the dishwasher. All right, here we go. I'm going to airdrop this. See, I already forgot what I was doing. Photos, select. And if you only have this much time, look how many you can get done in maybe 20 minutes, right? Airdrop. Look. So the amount of time you spend on a listing should be comparable to how much it's worth, in my opinion. I agree with that for sure. Like this is worth nine dollars. Like I'm not gonna, you know. Yeah. I'm just not gonna. <laughs> Nobody's got time to stress over that. Look, see, that looks fine. It looks great. It's totally fine. Oh, we better get Elsa. I have no idea. I've never seen Frozen in my life, but I know like Elsa. <laughs> Things you learn Frozen. being a reseller. Oh, I know. Okay, so I'm just going to, whatever. Tumblr, da da da. Oh, that's the Pyrex. We're going to copy and paste our title down here. If you want to see us list like this every night, we're on YouTube where you can see us. Um, blue Lid has a bit of discoloration but still in great shape Let's see photos okay you know this is 995 
then I'm going to do, I think we can take first class on this. Yeah, I think so too. First class, which is $4.99 for us. Six. List. Boom. Boom. Okay, this is a Ray Dunn teapot. I don't know, maybe I should Google lens this because it's like the typeset. Yeah. Google. I, I've been so scared to list this. Why? I don't care. It's just a Ray Dunn teapot. <laughs> For some reason, I've been like, no. Okay, here we go. So, when you find it on eBay, $35. Why have I been worried? You can click on the Google Lens eBay listing, go visit. This is another hot tip. Hot and tip. And then scroll down to the bottom and say sell similar and save it as a draft. Sell one like this. Oh, I get to log in again. It's my favorite. Okay, Tim, let me do that. Mm -mm. I really need to log in. Okay, well, let me do that. But that's how you could do it. For some reason, it's not letting me log in. I'm not going to let that slow me down. Normally, I would, like, dig into it. Why won't <laughs> this work? So you're just typing in the exact title uh -huh. from the... I see. Okay. Is that coming? Oh, yes, it is. Okay, so I want to look at sold, because I don't care what's listed. So when it has a line through it, that means it sold for best offer. Okay. So this one sold for 20. Like I do not need to stress about this. It sold for $20 and this one sold for best offer, but sold yesterday. So I'm okay. gonna copy this one. $20 shipping. This gives me an estimate of what yep. I should be charging. For sure. So I'm gonna put it at $29.95 plus $20 shipping. I'm just gonna, did you see that hustle mug? I want that. Oh, I did not. Okay, so I'm gonna take <laughs> pictures. Here we go. Here we go, Ray Dunn. Take all the pictures. And Dan would photo room these. There's an app called Photo Room, but I'm not using that today because that gets me into my OCD mode. And I'm, not, <laughs> I'm, I'm beating that today. All right, Today all is right. for the day when you ain't got time, where you're just like, I have got to get this done. Because at the end of the day, listings are the most important thing. Y'all, I am just taking every kind of picture. I do not. There's no flaws on this that I've seen, so I'm just, like, getting in there, you know? Mm -hmm. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. And for some reason, it looks good on my camera, and then when I import it into eBay, it's darker. I don't really know why. Okay, here we go, though. Send all photos. Did you get one of the logo on the bottom? Oh, no, I didn't. That's mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Rookie mistake. <laughs> a logo on the bottom always a logo on the bottom okay. and notice I'm not cleaning them like crazy either because that would be a you know a speed bump so one two three six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen so we gotta take one of these out that one you can only have twelve airdrop to my macbook so I take the photos first, and then I fill in the listing. It's much faster, because eBay takes a while to upload these photos. Okay, so the condition is used. Excellent use condition. No chips or cracks. Ray Dunn, white, ceramic. So um, I think, you know, selling similar is so much faster, because somebody's already like put in this information for you. You just have to check it and make sure that it's Accurate. Like number yeah. of items in set six. What? No, honey. No. See, somebody didn't check. You just gotta, <laughs> you gotta check it. Okay. No chips or cracks. Let's see photos. I'm gonna do my price down here, which is what did I say? Twenty nine ninety five. Yep. We're gonna do uh, priority shipping, and then I'm gonna edit the shipping cost to $20.99, because that's what they did, hopefully. And we know that that'll probably get the job done. Okay, let's see if the pictures are done, yep. So I'm just gonna increase the brightness, then the contrast, Ooh. and I know, see it gets a little, it's a little wonky, so we just might have there to, you go. That's, that's decent. you know, it's, it, it is what it is. <laughs> Do you know how many terrible pictures are on eBay? Exactly. 
And you can do this. Like, it doesn't have to. It's, watch, when this sells, I'm going to tell you how it's sold. And you're going to be like, what? Even with those crappy pictures? Yes, ma'am. They don't, it's not a photography contest. If they want the <laughs> item, they're going to buy the item. You're right. You are right. Done. Listed. Take it from me. Okay, last one. Y'all, I have not listed this because I don't know what it is at all. I don't know the brand. I don't know anything. So I'm just going to Google lens it right quick. See if you get lucky. I mean, I did it before. Like, I said years ago. I don't know. <laughs> However long we've had this months ago. Okay, I'm just gonna, as soon as I find something that's gonna work, I'm gonna go for it. So a lot of these say Anchor Hawking, but mine doesn't say Anchor Hawking, you know? So I know what it is, so I'm just gonna list it as what it is. It's a milk glass, based on what Google's telling me, I don't know. Here we go, well, vintage. I, this, is what I, this is what I'm gonna call it. I don't know what it is. Yeah. It's like not worth that much, right? So who cares? Vintage milk glass plate with lace edge. All right. This one says Westmoreland. I wonder if it's Westmoreland. Let's see. It kind of looks like these, but it's not these. Not as. It doesn't look so fancy. It's not so fancy. Oh, what about oh, this one though? It looks like that one. Kinda. Well, kind of. See, they don't know either. <laughs> so let me take out Westmoreland. They don't know. Nobody knows. Nobody knows. Nobody knows what they're listing. Nobody cares. Oh, here we go. Hey. Here we go. So I'm just going to take out Anchor Hawking because I don't know if it's Anchor Hawking, but it kind of looks like it. Right? Right. So I'm going to do. It's all Perfect. similar. And I'm not going to the solds on this one because I don't know. I just don't know. I don't know what's going on. Vintage. I don't know why it's in all caps. I don't care. White milk glass plate, lace edge with original sticker. I don't have the original sticker. So let's just see if it's eight inches. Let's see if it's eight inches. Yep. All right. Perfect, eight inches. Okay, I'm gonna go to my photos, oh. camera. See, I'm doing all the hard stuff too. White on white is another reason why I didn't do these because I was worried, you know, about how the photos would turn out. Yeah. Because it is white on white. I was like, oh, they're going to look terrible. There's no logo on this, so I don't know what I'm... Girl, I do not know. Don't care. Just like, rando pictures. Hello. Oh, there's a little ring there. Okay. Great. Here, we'll, we'll do this. Just put a little ruler action. Oh, there you go. Girl, I did not know. Look at that. Boom. Profesh. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I got an air time. Y'all need this video so bad. Nobody make video like this. Okay, here we go. What am I doing? Oh, I need to go to all photos. Got excited because of my ruler. Yeah. I upgraded. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Airdrop. MacBook. Mm -hmm. Go down where the photos are. Here we go. Dragging them over. Okay, eight um, dish, jewelry, tray, trinket, <laughs> plate. Was that already say plate? Uh, tray, trinket, tray. I already put tray. Okay, it's fine. There you go. EUC. I try to use up as many things as I can. Yeah. Like without getting too over the top. Use excellent use condition. No chips or cracks. Uh, what if I put unbranded? Not a lie. Okay. See how dark they come in versus when I'm taking them? Mm -hmm. Isn't that it's so interesting? It's not you guys. It's, it's definitely eBay. Don't worry about it. So even with the most difficult things to photograph, I'm still getting this done in record time. You guys could do this. Even if it's not five things, you could do two things or one thing, you know, as long as you're getting something done. 
Don't use that button. <laughs> Lord. <laughs> okay. Come on now. What's gonna happen here? One more. I don't have to go. I didn't have to do all these. Oh. oh. <laughs> Where'd it go? Okay, we're gonna price this anchor hogging. I'm gonna put unbranded. I don't know what brand this is. Okay, I gotta copy the title. I need to make sure all these are caps. For SEO, you want to capitalize. Pack tip. Okay. Not all caps. Like, I don't know, this person is yelling, but I don't care. <laughs> Oh my gosh, this has been in our death pile for so long. I can't even, I can't tell you how long it's been in our death pile. So I'm so happy to get this listed. I'm going to promote it. 7.6 and list. Yes, nicely done. What was the time? 25 minutes exactly. So five minutes of listing. Yeah? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yes, from start to finish. That's pretty awesome. Okay, let's ship. All right, let's do it action all right so we are over here on the shipping side and the things that hold us up the most when shipping are there's two major things the first one is not having the correct supplies on hand so what we did to fix that is we figured out the things that we sell the most and we bought the supplies we need to ship those things. I know it sounds obvious. And the thing, I mean, and to, to fit them properly. So for like little toys and plush and stuff, we have these padded. Let's measure uh, that and give them the measurement. Padded poly mailers that are, when you close them, they're seven by five, seven by five and a half. Okay. And those work for almost all of our little toys that we store in these shelves. Right. And then for clothes? Um, for clothes, we find the majority of stuff fits really well into these uh, nine by, are these nine by 12? Yeah. I think they're nine by 12. Yep. Great. Yep, nine by 12s. Okay, and then what's the second thing that holds us up? This one has to do with me. <laughs> uh, the second thing is looking for problems before you pack stuff up. <laughs> okay. And what I mean is, uh, if you, like a pair of pants, for example, if we store them like this in these plastic bags, um, instead of just taking the item as is, sticking it in the poly mailer and go, you have to resist the urge to open it, unfold it, and like, okay, do I need to lint roll this? Do I need to... Do I need to spend extra time packaging it? Do I need to fold it better? Right, no. no. <laughs> These people are buying... Here's how I get past this. All right, let's, let's go, and we're going to time it, and I'm going to talk while we do this. Okay. Because a lot of this is me getting over my own hurdles. Okay. Okay, ready? Uh, we have we... six things to ship, and we're going to see if we can do it in, like, five or six minutes. Okay. Wow, ready? Yep. Go. Okay. So the Thomas the Train is the first one, and we keep the stuff in these little bins in these plastic bags. We started using the plastic bags. Just go, baby. We just started using the plastic bags because we found that things sitting in the bins were getting dusty, and then I was having to clean them again before we shipped them. So we use these plastic bags, and they also provide some protection. We throw it straight into a poly mailer, and it's ready to go. Padded, yeah. Yeah, this pad. Sorry, a padded. Whatever. No, I'm just... Okay, okay, and so I'm going to weigh that... Four ounces. So that helped us a lot and having the exact size that we needed. Yeah. Now see, this is me. I'm like, is this enough padding? Here's the deal, you guys. This is this sold for like ten dollars. If it gets there and it's broken, we're out ten dollars. Like I no, cannot we're spend not, we're not out. $10. We're not out ten dollars. We paid forty nine cents for this. There we're out go. forty nine cents. I can't let my brain go there. Okay, this was just <laughs> You didn't Hugo, show. Boss, Hugo Boss pants. Thing. Hugo Boss dress pants went from their bag straight into the poly mailer, sealed up. Okay. They weigh 13 ounces. This isn't a what's sold, so. Right. We're just going to. We're if just you're curious, you this is a tiny beanie boo, blue owl. But look, it's in a bag straight into the bubble mailer. Bubble mailer. That's the are you, word. I are was... you timing this? I am. Yes. Come okay, on. Okay, okay, okay. See, when you have the right supplies on hand, it goes much faster. So true. Two ounces. This is like a little cosmetic. So again, these little bubble mailers are perfect 
for this kind of stuff. We sell a lot of this because of Amy's subscription boxes. Me. <laughs> Done. Boom. So stop picking up things that are hard to ship. That's the, that's the moral of the story. Right? Okay. Uh, these Citizens of Humanity jeans are over a pound, so you have to ship them priority mail. And they fit really nicely into these priority paper envelopes. And we order them a hundred at a time and we have them right here. We don't have to go looking for them. The pants are over a pound, we grab it, we go. And this is the most economical way to ship a pair of jeans that weigh over a pound. And again, it doesn't have to look super pretty. Okay. And it works. We sold this Lego Star Wars manual. Right. Oh, let me just get it. We have this bin of flaps over here. Yeah, we take... Sometimes when we cut down boxes, we save all the extra cardboard specifically for something like look, this. Look, look at that. So I'm going to take this and just wrap it in this cardboard. <laughs> Literally real, so real easy. Real fancy-like, just to give it some sturdy, extra sturdy protection for the ride in the mail. For the ride! To wherever it's going. But again, we save the flaps because we know we have this kind of stuff that's going to come up. Right. And it's ready to go. And I don't have to spend a bunch of time stressing about it or looking for something that's going to work. And then it even works with this same poly mailer. Just boom. There you go. Done. Is this going media mail? Uh, I think so. So we need the measurements of the poly. So he's nine by nine. Okay, and, and weighs five ounces. Five ounces, and we're done. Nope, nope we got one, one more. more. Ah, one more. Where's the ticket for even, this? I don't have one yet. <laughs> We're playing our favorite game. What is this thing? Oh no, here, are we out no, of the tiny? No, they're over here. Oh, they're over there. Okay. I was about to panic. We are <laughs> almost out. I gotta order more. That's the other thing. When you're running low, just order it as soon as you recognize you're running that's, low. That's me. That's yeah. my thing. I've been putting off a Costco order for like three days. I gotta do it today. Gotta do it. <laughs> Great. Okay. That Boom. Let's print out these labels. So a, we use a Dymo printer. Here you go. Uh, we find that it is the fastest way to ship. You're going to see at the end here the time. Dymo or Rollo or whatever you use, a thermal printer is a must if you're going to be doing this for any length of time, I, I think. I agree with that. Taping on these labels, time is money. You, you see how fast we listed something? Five minutes. So it takes you five minutes to tape on a label. You could have listed something. That's all I'm saying. That's right. <laughs> Grabbing an idea bag to put our purchases in. We are in. All right. All right. Ready? I'm ready. And coming up. If you're interested in how we do all the labeling and the shipping, we have an entire playlist called Daily Grind. It's three months of us packing and shipping. <laughs> Go head over there, binge watch it, learn all you need to know. Today is about getting stuff done quickly. Yeah. Download these labels that I just purchased through the bulk shipping option. Select my Dymo printer and go. Okay, we have a check and double check system. We do use tickets, but it's our own thing. Okay, this is Thomas the Train. Not important. <clears throat> The label fits perfectly on the thing. The Hugo Boss pants. You could also just write on the package what's inside of it. Uh, the Beanie Boo, the owl. In case there's multiple Beanie Boos. Sometimes going out today. there are. <laughs> Who are we? Uh, the Under Eye Brightener. Like, yeah, if we were printing labels out on our laser printer and having to fold and or cut and tape, we would still be working on package number one. Uh, the Citizens of Humanity pants. Lego Star Wars manual. I used to get hung up in making sure the labels were on printed. I mean, stick perfectly, you know, without any wrinkles. I don't do that anymore. <laughs> <laughs> and last one, Snuggle Bear. Okay, so what was that, seven or eight? Seven? Six and a half minutes. 
No, how many things? Oh, seven. Seven things in, so that's less than a minute a thing. Well, All yes. right. <laughs> Tuesday's moment with Mojo. Hey, friend. What are you doing? Oh. Hi, you're a good boy. Say hi to all your friends. <laughs> all right, hey, all right. I gotta go to the post office, but I'll see you in a few minutes, okay? Well, whenever you let me go. Go boy. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with us today. Hopefully this video was helpful and you can refer to it over and over and over again when you're lacking motivation and or time. That's right. And we will see you back here tomorrow. Bye. Bye.